Hello everybody, my name is Zach, aka The Weather Gamer, bringing you week one of the Little Monster Cup LMC uh, battle versus Matthias BBH and the Tatstrup Togepies, I believe. Yes, Tatstrup Togepies. Sorry. Uh, this video is being post-commentated, or the match is being post-commentated. Um, this match has actually been over for well over a week now. Um, I'm just way behind in recording videos. If most people haven't noticed, I kind of went dead on the channel again because I haven't been able to get things recorded. Just school, life, and all that are really bouncing on me right now. So, trying to mass record right now. Um, there's no team builder because here's the thing. I built the team on my tower, which is what I'm currently using right now when I'm streaming and all that. And Matthias messaged me early in the week um, that this match went up, or during the week that this match went up. He's like, hey, I'm free now. Can we play? I was like, e yeah, sure. Let me build my team. Do -do -do. I knew what six mods I brought, but I don't remember the items and I don't remember all the moves I brought. So anyways, there's no team builder because the team that's on my desktop is not the team that I brought. And the team that I brought, I deleted after the match, not thinking about it. So I don't actually know what team I brought off the top of my head completely. So this is what we're rolling with. No, we're not listening to this because I will get copyright struck. Thank you. Maybe. Yeah, there we go. Um, so yeah. Kind of, kind of mucked that one up, and I apologize, guys. There's no, there won't be a team builder for week one. So actually, and again, I should have pulled this up. Let's bring up the um, LMC right now, and just go over the team again. So, uh, oh right, um, I made a free agent addition. Um, we dropped execute and picked up Oddish. Um, that won't go in effect until week three, though. So um, that's why there's this empty spot. So right now, for this match, we had Vulpix, Scraggy, Cranidos, Electrike, Noibat, um, Barbroach, Munchlax, Execute, um, Shield On, and Golette um, as our options. Um, the... Togepies have this. Uh, oh, I gotta get LGM on the screen here. There we go. So we have Zero. Why do I keep calling Zorar Zara Aura? That's like the draft stream. I screwed this up too. We have Zorora. Chimchar, Buizel, Elgium, Rog and Roll, Togepi, Amoong... Not Amoongus. Fungus. Swellow, Spinarak, and Pichu. Um, obviously, Buizel is a huge threat. It outspeeds everything naturally. Um, Chimchar hits extremely hard. Elgium can set up and hit extremely hard. Um, he's got webs, and he can disguise with uh, Zorora. I'm going to screw that up forever. So, we see Zerara, <laughs> Spinarak, uh, Buizel, Elgium, Swellow, and Chimchar. I brought Vulpix, Cranidos, Munchlax, um, Electric. What is that thing's name? Scraggy. And, uh, Noivern. Noibat. 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 Um, again, for those of you that didn't see the previous video, this league is, when I did the draft recap, this league for me is a fun league. Um, this league is not something I'm taking serious, like the WWC or another league that I will be unveiling shortly that I joined, um, another competitive league um, that we've got coming. Um, the draft recap for that one will be going up here very shortly as well. Um, so this is more just for me to have fun, hang out with friends, um, enjoy battles, um, all that. Um, Matthias and I have a huge battling history. Um, well, he, I say huge. Compared to 
um, some of the other people that are in this league. Um, Matthias and I have squared off numerous times. Um, I'm actually going to pull this up because I can't remember what the score is on uh, Matthias versus I. Um, I know I stole my match versus him in the WWC. Um, I managed to hack and beat him. Um, did I ever play you, Matthias? That's the question. Like, did we ever play? What were you in this one? Copenhagen Cacturns, was that you? Yep. Okay, so the very first time I ever played Matthias, I lost. It was a 1-0 loss. Then we played in WWC. That was a 1-0 win. So 1-1, one 1-1 and one, one apiece. Um, so 1-1 one and one plus 0. Then... I played Matthias in the GPC, which is a league that died after two weeks, and I got 6 0 by him. So now I'm 1 and 2 minus 6 versus Matthias. Um, Matthias is a great battler. I love playing games against him. Um, he's always got great team prep, and I'm very happy to say that Matthias is one of my. Um, front office members most of you if you haven't checked out the update videos and that when I where I've talked about it I put together a front office because I was tired of losing and tired of winning with only like one O's two O's I need help team building I need help getting better I've said all this before Matthias is one of my um, front office members and so like having him I know what kind of battler he is and how good he is, and I hope to get to be as good as Matthias is with learning from Matthias and practice and all that, because I would like to beat him again, uh, not by hacks, um, which is another thing. The 6-0 I suffered in GPC had a lot of hacks to it, and my win in the WWC had a lot of hacks to it. So, I'd like a non-hacksy game for once versus Matthias, so, looking at team comp, um, oh, I forgot what I was going at when I said this is a fun league. Sorry, side tangents. Continue. Um, I did nickname all my Pokemon, so we got Vulpix, Firefox the Vulpix. We have C Drive the Cranny Dose after the legendary Dan, aka A Drive. We got I Got Munchies the Munchlax. We got the Thunder Down Under, um, our Australian Electrike. We've got Balam after Hoodlum Scrafty, um, the Scraggy, and we have Noibatan for our Noibat. So looking at this, God, what did I even lead? I'm sorry, guys. I haven't watched it. I led Thunder Down Under. So Thunder Down Under, I believe. Um, I don't remember. I think it had Flamethrower, Thunderbolt, HP, Ground, I want to say, and... Volt switch? Something like that. Um, he dark pulses. That immediately says, okay, this is Zerara. Um, and he gets the flinch. What did I just say about freaking hacks, Matthias? Matthias and I cannot have... A, and he makes... Com you guys can't see the comments, but I literally go, after I get flinched from the dark pulse, I go, really? First turn hacks again? Because every match we play, hacks are there. And Matthias just laughs back about, that's how our games go. And it's true. We haven't had a clean game where hacks did not play a part in who won and who lost the game. So I bring in Balam. It's a resisted hit. And I figured, okay, hidden powers. Um, that's got to be hidden power flying or something else. Um, that... Um, was super hidden can't be fairy so it had to be hidden power flying or hidden power fighting it just i knew this was Zor, uh zorark Zor, not zorark zorora at this point um i set up a d dance figuring okay a second one of those isn't gonna kill me i should be faster now and i can one shot this thing with brick break because i'm pretty sure i was running brick break crunch fire punch it was either Fire or Thunder Punch. I'm pretty sure it was Fire Punch. And uh, Dragon Dance. So I D-Dance, Thunder Punch. It was Thunder Punch. I hit. It is the um, 
Zorora. I figured with me setting up though, um, Swell or Talo might come in. This is one of those things that I need to be better about. I should have just brick braked. I should have just brick braked. I would have outsped the Talo unless it was scarfed, anyways. I should have brick braked, killed the Zorora right here, and then kept going. Instead, I Thunder Punch predicting the Talo. I am terrible at 50 50s. And this is something my front office, this is why I practice every week with my front office six, seven, eight, nine, ten games a week sometimes we play. Um, where I get put into these 50 50 positions and I have to make a guess and hope that I'm right. And seven out of ten times I'm wrong. And that's scary for me. And that's something I have to get better about. Um, I shouldn't have gone for the 50 50 of Talo Brick Break and then Outspeed would have gotten it. He hidden powers and it kills me. Um, the crit didn't matter. I know it was hacks again, but that crit had no no matter. He did 48% to me the first time. 43 would have been well within the range of it. So I go down with that. In comes Cranidos. Grass Knot. This thing gets Drain Punched. Okay, I had Drain Punch, not Brick Break. I had Drain Punch. That's what I had. Drain Punch. Should have drain punched um, and killed Zorora that way. And I didn't, which was stupid on my part. This thing gets Grass Knot? I didn't know that. Again, this is something my front office would have caught me on and told me this, but I'm not building I'm not building with my front office for Little Cup. Um, Little Cup for me is just, I'm experimenting. I'm playing around. I'm seeing what works in Little Cup that I might be able to play around with and bring to... Um, big cup leagues so grass not huge damage to c drive but i'm gonna end up getting the kill with iron head and beat that in comes Bweasel, and he named it fizzle and for those of you that don't know fizzle hizzle before he left wwc the ta he runs the team the tampa bay Bweasels. um if you checked him out when i linked him back then um Tampa Bay Weasels. Um, he's just a great battler. He's he's above my skill. I'll admit that. He's a better battler than me. He's where I'm aiming to get right now. Like, how I see it, I'm in the F tier. Or the tier 5. I'm in tier 5 if you're talking draft league. I'm a tier 5 drafter right now. Battler right now. Matthias and the Blazing Savage, and SV Torn, and some of the other S um, Ostragonites, some of the other um, coaches in the WWC. I call them the uh, Tier 4 picks. Like, they're your Tier 4 mons. They're not quite, like, to Tier 3, where they'd be the top end in a Tier 3 or lower draft, but they're getting there. Then there's Fizzle. Fizzle and Bionic Soup is a great, another really good friend. I think I linked him down below um, a while back ago, um, too. Bionic Soup has been a great friend to me. He's helped me out of a jam several times when team building in the front office and I can't figure something out. Great dude. If you guys ever run across him in Deathly I Am server or anywhere else, Bionic Soup is a great guy. He won't steer you wrong, and he can be a very good friend. And that's just me saying that um they are they are the c tier players like they're not they're not they're not your a drives they're not your deathly i am's your gators your um your that like the pros they're not the pros they're the semi pros that's how i'm trying to say it they're the semi pros so he named it Fizzle because he knows that Fizzle has a tendency to taunt me sometimes. Um, and I can get very angry with Fizzle at times when I have to battle him. As most people know, I had a huge rage fit during my match with him and was unable to upload that video because of some things I said because I have a temper tantrum and a very bad temper at times. Um, as you've seen on stream, maybe. I have a temper issue. Um, anyways, um, so... I don't know if he just named it Fizzle because everybody hates playing Fizzle. Like, when Fizzle left WWC, most of the coaches were happy. Just because we could all breathe and not get killed by it. So, 
In comes Bweezel. Bweezel's fast. It power-up punches. Now it's plus one attack. And I'm kind of screwed at this point. Noibat comes in. He ice punches. He's got the coverage. Plus one ice punch with life orb kills me. I got munchies. I'm going to try and set up a curse. He hits me with Noxie. I pop it out of my hands. I figure, okay, maybe a curse. I live a plus one life orb aqua tail, even though it just did 4% to me, or 96% to me. I thought, okay, if I survive, I curse, and then maybe I can survive, and then I recycle, and I get the berry, and then I... Maybe I set up? Nope, Aquatel, shut down. The crit hurt. I don't think the crit mattered. Um, then Electric doesn't outspeed. Power up punches again. In comes this thing. Aquatel, bye-bye, and that's it. Oh, Matthias, why? Why? Aside from one hacks, where you got the first turn flinch, which may have made a difference, I don't know. The first turn flinch mattered, in my opinion. Um, getting the crits later in the match didn't matter. <sighs> Matthias is now 6 0 and 5 0 me in back to back games. I'm not happy, Matthias. You're a great dude. You're going to be my friend. I'm so glad I don't have to battle you for, like, position for at least until playoffs at WWC. Because I got to regroup and I got to figure out how to beat you without getting hacks in my favor. Um, yeah. So, thank you, Matthias, because this is now two leagues in a row. You've dropped me to 0-1, minus 6 or minus 5. You did it to me in W or GPC, and you did it to me here. Matthias is a great dude. If you guys ever run into him, if you join my Discord server and you want to hang out and say hi to Matthias, he's in my Discord server pretty often. Um, I know he's in Dan, aka a Drives Discord servers, um, because he's in a server with me that I can't talk about. Don't ask me any questions about that server. That server doesn't exist. Um, but I know he's in, I believe he's in A Drive's main um, Discord server too. I'm not, just because I don't have the money to subscribe to A Drive, unfortunately. So when I get the money, I will be in A Drive's server and you guys can say hi. Um, but yeah, uh, Matthias, great battle. Um, way to sweep me with Weasel. That thing is overpowered. We need to nerf it. Um, let's just hope we rebound re week two. Um, week two, we play Griffin Feathers. Another one of my great, like, this league is just full of my friends. As I said in the draft recap, this video, this league is just a very friendly league full of amazing people that have been with me for almost as long as I have been streaming and uploading to YouTube. These are all people that I've known and met from very early on. Um, outside of, I think, Shadow Sky is the only one that I actually don't know is Shadow Sky and Nikki. They're the two that I don't know as well. Um, just because I just met them recently when GPC started. But Damien I've known forever since the DSL. Torn has been with me since um, I started streaming. Um, the Blazing Savage has been with me since WWC started. Um, Griffin Feathers I've known since DSL. Griffin Feathers is the one that made this layout you're looking at. Griffin Feathers and I have a special, um, we have a special, um, new piece of art coming for, um, you guys. Um, like I said, I did enter another league. Unfortunately, I was not able to run the Chicago Bear Ticks for that league, as it's a D-League, and the main league has Chicago Bear Ticks. So I'm not allowed to run the Bear Ticks. So, we're unveiling a new team, um... And so I have a surprise for you guys coming from Griffin Feathers, the wonderful artist and great dude, um, whose link is always in the description down below. You can always um, follow him on Twitter, show him some love for me from you guys, um, and join the Discord server, and you can come talk and hang out. He posts a lot of his artwork in the Discord server. He posts a lot of his artwork on, the, on his Twitter. Um, definitely check him out, and if you need... He's very reasonably priced. You can always commission him 
when he's not busy with school. I will say that. When he, school isn't his priority, which it absolutely should be. It's the same with me. School is my priority. This comes second. But his art is well worth it and all that. So, now that I've praised everybody, thank you, Matthias. Great battle. Looking forward to battling Griffin next week. Or I guess at the time of recording, I've already played Griffin. But looking forward to playing Griffin for the rest of you. Yes, I broke the fourth wall there. Shocker. Thank you guys for checking out. I will catch you guys in the next one. See ya.